I'm addressing a matter of significant national importance. I intend to raise it on the floor of parliament, but it appears that the fiscal absence of the speaker himself may probably not allow me to do that today. So I'm compelled to address you whilst I prepare to raise it on the floor of parliament where Speaker Buckley himself is presiding. And I'm addressing you on the basis of a letter dated 18th March 2024 signed by Nana Bediutu Asante, Secretary to the President, addressed to the Clerk of Parliament, and it reads, Transmission of the Human Sexual Rights and Family Values Bill 2024. I'll make copies available to you all, distinguished ladies and gentlemen of the press. But I'm unable to sleep. And I'm unable to sleep because this is a monumental threat to Ghana's democracy and a monumental threat to Parliament as an institution. By Article 93, we are close with legislative authority and legislative mandate. This letter only reflects President Nana Adudankwe's quest of predominance over other organs of state. That is unacceptable and that must be fought by all persons who love democracy and who cherish the principles and values of the 1992 Constitution. The framers of our Constitution endowed Ghana with separation of powers, the executive, the legislature, the judiciary. Division of powers. It endowed as that parliament shall be responsible for law making. President Nana Adudankwa, first of all, politically, what power does the present secretary have writing to the clerk of parliament? And not the president himself writing directly to the Speaker of Parliament, as is required of our standing order, so that officially this can be read as communication from the President. So ideally, this paper means nothing and should be ignored by the clerk, because communication to Parliament must be communication signed by the President, addressed to the Speaker of Parliament, as is required of our standing orders, whether old or new. Two, yes, there is a matter before court, but I'm also a trained lawyer. An attempt to seek an injunction is not the same thing as an injunction. An attempt, I'm seeking an injunction, does not operate the same way as an injunction has been so granted by the court, even if it is an interlocutory injunction. But more importantly, Parliament cannot be injunct not to perform its lawful function as the legislature of Ghana, clothed under Article 93, responsible for legislation. No organ of state. Subject to the Constitution. The judiciary is subject to the Constitution. The executive is subject to the Constitution. The legislature is subject to the Constitution. So it's, it's for good reason that all of them the Constitution is subject to this Constitution. The legislative authority is vested in the Parliament of Ghana. 